Math Grade 1 Quarter 1 Week 6 Day 1 Let's learn about Compose and Decompose Numbers 4 and 5 Matatag Curriculum Hello kids! It's me, Teacher Frel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and hit the notification bell for the latest video. You can also follow my Facebook page, Teacher Frel TV. For today's lesson in Math 1, we will discuss about Compose and Decompose Numbers 4 and 5. Learning Competencies The learners compose and decompose numbers up to 10 using concrete materials. For example, 5 is 5 and 0, 4 and 1, 3 and 2, 2 and 3, 1 and 4, 0 and 5. Day 1 At the end of the lesson, the learners shall be able to Compose and decompose the numbers 4 and 5 Tell the number of objects in each set Write the numeral under it Let us see the first set How many bees are there? Can you count? Correct! There are 5 bees Second set how many butterflies are there? Can you count? Correct! There are 3 butterflies Third set How many trees are there? Can you count? Correct! There are 4 trees Our lesson for today is about composing and decomposing the numbers 4 and 5 Read the following words 1 2 3 4 5 0 Set Composing Making a set Putting together Decomposing Breaking up a set What objects are these? These are scissors How many scissors are there? Can you count? There are 4 scissors How do you know there are 4 scissors? We counted the scissors I have 4 balls I gave one ball to Dustin And I gave three balls to Dan Can you count the ball of Dustin? One Can you count the balls of Dan? One Two Three How four was broken down? The number 4 was broken down into 1 and 3 1 ball which I gave to the steen And 3 balls which I gave to Dan Let us see this illustration I have 4 balls I gave 1 to the steen And 3 to Dan 4 is 1 and 3 What if I gave 2 balls to each of them? How can we illustrate this? I gave two balls to Dustin and two balls to Dan. Let us count the balls of Dustin. One, two, and count the balls of Dan. One, two. Now, how four was broken down? The number 4 was broken down into 2 and 2 Let us see this illustration I have 4 balls I gave 2 balls to Dustin And 2 balls to Dan So this is 4 is 2 and 2 
Let us do this activity. Decompose the set of four balls into two groups. Draw the balls and write the corresponding numbers in the empty box. Give answers that are different from the given examples below. 4 is 1 and 3 and 4 is 2 and 2. This is number 1, number 2, and number 3. Let's see again this example. So this is 4 is 1 and 3. And another example is 4 is 2 and 2. Let's answer number 1. 4 is broken down into 3 and 1. So the answer is 4 is 3 and 1. For number 2, another possible answer is 4 is broken down into 4 and 0. So the answer is 4 is 4 and 0. And the possible answer for number 3 is 4 is broken down into 0 and 4. The answer is 4 is 0 and 4. Let us summarize the answers in a table. In the first column, we have the given 4. In the second column is learner A. And in the third column is learner B. In the first set, Learner A is 0 and Learner B is 4. Next set, 1 and 3. Third set, 2 and 2. Fourth set, 3 and 1. And fifth set, 4 and 0. Now, observe the data presented in the table. What do you observe? Let us read the pairs of numbers given in the table. 4 is 0 and 4. 4 is 1 and 3. 4 is 2 and 2. 4 is 3 and 1. 4 is 4 and 0. How many pairs did we get? Correct! We got 5 pairs. The number 4 was broken down into pairs of numbers. This process is called decomposing a number. Let's take a look again this diagram. If we put together one ball and three balls, what do we get? Correct! We get four balls. Right? One and three makes four. How about two balls and two balls? We also get four balls. Right? Two and two makes 4. Let us read the pairs of numbers. 0 and 4 makes 4. 3 and 1 makes 4. 4 and 0 makes 4. We make 4 by putting together two numbers. This process is called composing a number. What do you observe about the pair of numbers into which 4 was broken down and the pair of numbers used to make 4. The pairs of numbers are the same. Check if this is also true for the other pairs of numbers. What if we had 5 balls instead of 4? How do we decompose the number 5? How do we compose the number 5? So let us do this activity. Decompose the set of 5 balls into 2 groups. Draw the balls and write the corresponding numbers in the empty boxes. Fill in the blanks. So there are 6 sets in here. So let us answer numbers 1 to 6. Here are the possible answer. So this is in any order. So the pair of numbers used to make 5 is 0 and 5. 0 and 5 makes 5. Number 2, the pair of numbers used to make 5 is 1 and 4. 1 and 4 makes 5. 
Number 3. The pair of numbers used to make 5 is 2 and 3. 2 and 3 makes 5. Number 4. The pair of numbers used to make 5 is 3 and 2. 3 and 2 makes 5. Number 5. The pair of numbers used to make 5 is 4 and 1. 4 and 1 makes 5. And for number 6, the pair of numbers used to make 5 is 5 and 0. 5 and 0 makes 5. What is the process of breaking down a given number into pairs of numbers? It is called decomposing a number. And what is the process of putting together two numbers to make a bigger number? It is called composing a number. The number 5 was broken down into 1 and 4. 1 and 4 makes 5. What do you observe about the pair of numbers into which 5 was broken down and the pair of numbers that are used to make 5? Correct! The pairs of numbers are still the same. Is this also true for the number 4? Yes! How many pairs of numbers can we get if we compose and decompose a number? The number of pairs is 1 more than the given number. If the number is 4, we get 5 pairs. If the number is 5, we get 6 pairs. Let us try this activity. Number 1, connect the pair of numbers that makes 4. Let us connect 0 and 4. 0 and 4 makes 4. And let us connect 1 and 3. 1 and 3 makes 4. Second, connect the pair of numbers into which 5 may be decomposed. So 5 is broken down into 0 and 5. Another is 5 is broken down into 1 and 4. And 5 is broken down into 2 and 3. And number 3, write the missing numbers. For letter A, decompose 5. 5 is broken down into 2 and 3. The answer is 3. Letter B. Let us compose. So 4 and 1 makes 5. And for letter C, decompose 4. So 4 is broken down into 2 and 2. 4 is also broken down into 1 and 3. It is also broken down into 3 and 1. It is also broken down into 0 and 4. And 4 and 0. So kids, do you understand our lesson for today? Wow! Good job! Kids, I hope you learned a lot from this lesson. Until our next topic, bye-bye kids! Thanks for watching!